team title is here, we are going to do a type of wood breaking with hand techniques. Punch the target or ball. So we try to make your wrist straight, not like this or this angle, not this or not this. Okay, so make your two knuckles to straight, elbow to elbow, also shoulder. Now punch. Second one, we're gonna go through hand knot. In Korean, we say son knot chigi. When we check the hand knot, we try to use this part only. So try to not break or hit the target with this knuckle or pinky size. So try to make your hand knot part strong as you can. Third one, so we're gonna go through hammer fist. In Korean, we call it Mejumo. So, Mejumo part is this part. So, try to make you guys fist squeeze it hard as you can. So, when you squeeze your fist hard as you can, you will see a little bit bump out. So, you're gonna use this part and break the ball. Like this, or side leg. First one, we're gonna go through opposite hand line. This part. So, in Korean, we say, 역 손날 or 역 수. When you make opposite hand line, so try to use this part only. So, do not make a 역 손날 or opposite hand line like this, and then you're gonna hit the ball or break the ball with the top part. So please put your thumbs all the way in, make you guys a strong opposite hand knife part. Then same thing, don't try to hit like this, go straight, with the elbow slightly bent, go through. When you do Dum Jum up, back fist strike, you try to use two knuckles. So do not hit the ball with your top of your back of your fist. So if you hit the ball like this, yeah, same thing, you're gonna get a damage. So try to make you a strong knuckle to here, and then make your wrist straight, hit the ball this angle, not this. Or I cannot make it, not this. Okay. Fifth one, so we're gonna check your palm strike. In Korea, we say patam son chik. So when we do palm strike, so try to use your this part, not all of your palm, not like this. Okay, so slightly angle. So make your wrist to elbow slightly bent. Then using the this part to elbow straight. Strike. Seventh one, so we're gonna check it out front fit. We say, Kan Jumo. Korean word, so we're gonna open your feet. That's what the name meaning is, Kan Jumo. Here, but when you guys do Kan Jumo, do not just open this one, so make you squeeze your fingers like that curl your fingers tightly and then make your thumb side on the side and make your same as uh, when you do punch so wrist to your front of the knuckles make a straight 
and then try to target straight forward. Okay, so when we strike this, we can strike upfront solar plexus or fill fill. Here, here. Last one, we're gonna go through posturing fingers. In Korea, we say Sosung Jumo. When you make a Sosung Jumo, posturing fingers, make you guys same again, all of your finger curls, and then only middle fingers, not curls. Lift up, and then you're gonna hit the target with your middle knuckles. Then you're gonna attack up front, same as a Piltalon or Solar Pressers also side of your body and temple this way this way this way this way also chain I'm gonna strike thing this way here Watching everyone, so please uh, train hard. So don't forget to subscribe.